slept like crap last night. I had like a uh, like a really vivid nightmare. You ever get one of those where you were like right in there, straight up? And mine was <laughs> let's go figure. It was about it was about money. It was about finance. Uh, I dreamt that um, I wasn't where I needed to be to retire, which uh, is kind of crazy because the things that I do um, that most other people don't do um, to assure that retirement is great. I mean, it's a nightmare for some people. I was talking to a guy recently, you know, 1.3, 1.5 million in a 401k account, and uh, he's, he's, he's scared. And I understand why he's scared, because there's a few things that I do consistently that this guy, for example, wasn't doing, and he's number one. I, I assess every single one of my investments and ask myself a simple question. Number one, is my investment returning more than inflation? I'll say that again. Is my investment percentage, my, my returns, my ROI, return on investment, is it higher than inflation? People will, for some reason, which is beyond my imagination, people will invest in uh, retirement planning under the direction of an advisor, and I'm not crapping on advisors, everybody needs to earn a living, but what they'll do is, is they'll go out there and they'll take a, you know, maybe a 5% or a 4% after fees, and yet inflation, some people say is 6%, some people say it's 3%. So why on earth would you put capital to work at a deficit or just squeezing right along the line of, of breaking even and still expect a good retirement. It's just ridiculous to, to think that way. The other thing I do is, is I'm looking for diversification. I was talking to an attorney next to me um, in my, my neighborhood. That we, I went over and we were shooting the breeze. And I said, you know, a lot of people say diversification in the marketplace. And my take on it was this, and I'd be interested to see. Make a comment on this down below. My take on it was this, is that, yeah, okay, if you're diversified in the market, it's kind of like being on the Titanic. You could go in first class or you could go in steerage. But when it's going down, baby, it's going down no matter, no matter what classification you're in. So anyway, a couple of points, a couple of thoughts. Um, you know, it's midweek. Uh, things are moving. Uh, the fund is uh, in action. But anyway, what's your retirement look like? Are you 100% confident that you're going to get to where you need to be? And if you're not, what are you going to do about it, right? What are you going to do about it? Because at the end of the day, show me who uh, who somebody gets their financial advice from, and uh, I'll show you what their financial future looks like. All right, comment. Let me know. Let me know. Bye.